I'm Dr. Malisa Ami. I'm the consultant ophthalmologist and a specialist in pediatric ophthalmology and strabismus at Sunway Specialist Centre, Damansara. Strabismus uh, is a medical term for a squint, which means that the eyes are not in normal alignment. One eye is either misdirected outwards or inwards, or it can be upwards or downwards. Strabismus and lazy eye actually mean two different things. Strabismus, as I mentioned before, is a squint, a misalignment of the eye. Whereas lazy eyes refers to amblyopia, where the eyesight is reduced due to poor normal vision development in the brain. Strabismus is a wide range of a condition. Um, some of it can be congenital, so some strabismus can start at birth but not all strabismus are congenital and strabismus can be treated and we have to find out what is the cause of strabismus. So whether it's due to refractive error uh, whereby the child needs to wear glasses to improve vision or um, there are other causes and you need treatments like screen surgery or eye exercises. If it's a constant squint, uh, whereby the misalignment is there all the time, it's persistent, it is highly unlikely to resolve on its own. So it is a misconception that some parents may think that the child can outgrow a strabismus. So it is important for children who have a squint to have their eyes assessed because it could be due to poor vision in one eye or both eyes and have that treated and have the strabismus uh, managed well as well. Patching is actually a treatment for amblyopia, which is lazy eye. It is to train the poorer seeing eye to see better by patching the good eye. It is a part of the management of a child with strabismus, but it does not treat the strabismus or the squint itself. It is to treat the lazy eye. The squint itself is either treated um, by improving the eyesight with glasses and to treat the lazy eye or with squint surgery or eye exercises that is quite untrue. First aim of screen surgery is to restore binocular single vision because when one, when the eyes are misaligned, um, the child doesn't have three-dimensional vision because there's only one eye that sees well and the other eye is either suppressed or blurry. Therefore, strabismus surgery to align the eyes, to straighten the eyes again is number one if we can achieve stereopsis or binocular single vision again. But of course, it also improves the cosmesis. This video was made to increase the awareness about strabismus or squint in conjunction with the World Strabismus Day. Therefore, I would like to encourage um, any parent who has a child with a squint, or if you have a squint or anyone that you know, a relative or a friend, to tell them that strabismus can be treated and to get their eyes assessed by a specialist in strabismus. Thank you.